number one guy? Uh, you know, just go out there and make every play that's supposed to be made um, and the plays that aren't supposed to be made. Uh, I, I put a lot of pressure on myself, you know, to uh, be perfect, and I want to be perfect, and I'm not going to stop me, you know, till I get there or as close as I can. What's the most significant difference from your perspective between Coach Cheney's offense and Coach Enos's? Um, I feel like it's a little bit looser, you know. Uh, you can you can work your your style into it as well, but you're also you know running a, a more versatile offense, I guess you could say. But it's, it's it's complex at the same time. Are there things that carried over? I mean, with Brandon being a fifth-year senior guy, I can't imagine Coach Eno, Coach Enos wants to reinvent. Like yeah. start from scratch. How much carryover is there from the stuff y'all did last year? You no, know, there's been there's been a lot of carryover, you know. But he has some some adjustments in there that makes it a little different as well, you know. So, I mean, I'm I'm glad Coach Enos came, and I feel like you know we're gonna have a really great offense this year. With it being looser, you like that more? Yes, I love that. Yes, sir. Does it uh, just allow you to be more creative, maybe? Yeah, yeah. It allows you to be more creative. You know, <laughs> like I said, just work your style in there, work your you know sugar in there a little bit. Thanks, Keith. No doubt. Coach Smith kind of really wanted to boil it down, get the top six receivers to start rotating with Brandon. Who, who is that right now working with you guys? Um, you know, we have a couple guys. Um, we have a, I don't know if we have a top six yet, but like I said, we have we have a top seven and a top eight, and when those those two guys in the back, you know, they're trying to work their way in there. So it's just you know great competition, and guys are just out there steady working each and every day. Just continuing to build depth at the wide receiver spot, something that you haven't experienced in the past couple of years. Oh uh, yeah, you know, guys are just out there, you know, like I said, working to get better, um, and that's going to create depth. You know, competition and just you know working on your game, working on your technique and stuff like that. So I feel like you know we we've got a lot of depth, and we got some guys that can go out there and make. Place. I know Coach challenged you before practice. Have a good practice. You won't have to have a two at eight tomorrow. Would you say anything about that after practice? Um, yeah, I mean, if we had a good practice, he was going to let us sleep in a little bit tomorrow. So hopefully, you know, when he watches film, he thinks it's, you know, pretty good. Thanks, Kim.